This is Broadcast Beat Magazine with Ryan Salazar. Ryan Salazar here with Broadcast Beat Magazine. We have a special guest. His name is Srini, all the way in India from Amagi. How are you, Srini? I'm doing well. Thank you so much for having me, Ryan. So tell us about Amagi and what you guys do. Amagi is a, a broadcast 2.0 company. Uh, we are a media technology company that enables broadcasters, bar television networks, uh, to deliver their content anywhere worldwide, leveraging cloud platforms and uh, targeting their content and advertising to specific markets locally by regionalizing their feeds, uh, either whether it is on traditional cable, satellite, IPTV platforms or on OTT platforms. So essentially taking broadcasters to the next generation uh, media delivery platforms. That's what we are. So you're affecting feeds or are you versioning uh, files? Uh, two parts. One, uh, the whole flow is based on a file-based uh, workflow, the whole platform. Uh, what we do is we provide cloud-based delivery platforms uh, for delivering the assets to the edges, which is typically at the cable satellite head ends. And then at the edge, we stitch together the assets and provide a live linear stream. I can sit centrally at, you know, maybe at, in Miami, uh, maybe in a beach, and I can control my entire play out, maybe whether it's, a, whether it's in Africa or in Australia or in India, uh, run my entire content and play out and monitor it sitting from my laptop all over the cloud. So tell me a little bit more about the, re the channel regionalization that your system can do. Uh, we, we are seeing a lot of interest from television networks as they look to monetize uh, their content in countries where they are present. Uh, two big challenges that they see. Uh, one, uh, each one of these countries that the television networks expand to have their own regulatory framework and hence need to adhere to those specific countries, specific regulations. Two, uh, being able to monetize or insert local advertisements in each one of these regions. So we have uh, what is called as a STOM platform, uh, which is an IRD, a receiver-based solution, which allows the broadcaster or the television network centrally uh, to control the ad insertions happening anywhere across the globe on a satellite channel. Let's say I'm a television network, I'm broadcasting my feed on a, on a satellite. Now, leveraging the same satellite uh, bandwidth or using cloud as a platform, I can target specific regions, specific headings where I have my receivers and have different content or different advertising inserted in each one of these headings. And I can centrally control it from my location. Okay, and so now your equipment that goes at, so you have equipment that goes, and just excuse my ignorance because I don't know the product that well, but your, uh, your cloud system, does it, com it communicates remotely with equipment that's in other locations then? Yeah, so okay, uh, maybe I'll, I'll uh, split the product line. There are, actually, we are probably uh, talking about two different product lines here. One, we have what is called as a cloud port, which is our cloud-based or cloud-managed edge playout systems. Uh, this, as we discussed, uh, is where a server sits at cable, satellite, IPTV head ends. And uh, the television network can centrally push the content onto these edges and stitch, put together a playlist and completely run a live linear channel at the edges. And they can decide to run different content, different playlists, different advertising at each of the head ends or each of the different affiliate platforms. How long have you guys been around? We've been uh, around for about seven years. We started in 2008. Uh, again, uh, we started as a cloud-based regionalization company, even before the word cloud was popular among television networks. Uh, we built a television ad network in India uh, where we regionalize Indian television channels across different regions within India. In fact, we have about 12,000 edge devices deployed within India across different platforms and affiliates uh, where we centrally manage and control what gets inserted in different regions and run the entire ad network traffic operations 
uh, on a day-to-day -day basis. We actually do about a million second of advertising every month uh, for the television networks today in India. And subsequently started offering this about a couple of years back to television networks worldwide. Trini, thank you so much for sharing with us uh, some information about Amagi. Um, you guys seem to be a very impressive company and, and I have definitely seen your name and seen you guys around convention center floors. So, uh, so I really appreciate uh, uh, the chat this morning. And, and again, all the way from Bangalore, India. Oh, thank you so much. Thanks for taking the time. You know, it was wonderful talking to you, Ryan. Thanks a lot.